It seemed to be a normal day in Bikini Bottom. That day, SpongeBob asked Patrick if he wanted to go out to catch jellyfishes after work. However, Patrick made a weird expression and said, Do you know what a starfish is actually eat, SpongeBob? Here, let me show you. Then, Patrick explained how the stomachs of a starfish is extend out of their bodies to penetrate their prey and inject a deadly liquid into them. Bob was dumbfounded, and he would soon realize he had just discovered the most evil side of the starfish who he thought was his best friend. Patrick then extended some sort of tentacle from his insides and pierced the SpongeBob's yellow body. Shortly after, Bob collapsed, completely destroyed. After eating Bob's entire body, Patrick then went on to spread chaos across all of Bikini Bottom. Many of the citizens tried to stop him and avenge Bob, but the evil of Patrick Starr just couldn't be stopped that easily. How could he do that to his supposed best friend? Sandy was furious about this, so she quickly planned her revenge. She grabbed a huge katana and managed to slice Patrick Starr in half. That way, Sandy expected to finally end his destruction besieging Bikini Bottom. However, what Sandy didn't know was that starfishes can actually regenerate. Patrick's two severed halves regenerated, becoming two Patricks and thus multiplying their strength and evil. And the worst part is that dividing Patrick only increases his appetite for destruction. Sandy managed to escape and, very scared, went into the Krusty Krab. There, Mr. Krabs asked her where the heck was a SpongeBob that he was late and the customers were about to arrive. However, having witnessed how Patrick killed Bob and half of their neighbors, Sandy explained to Mr. Krabs what happened and asked him for help. They started by covering the windows to prevent Patrick from coming in. He had already killed half of the town, so they had to do everything they could to try to protect themselves. Sandy was extremely scared. She knew that evil starfish was still out there, and he knew exactly where she was. And she wasn't wrong. Quite suddenly, a horrible sound scared Sandy and Krabs even more. It was one of Patrick's tentacles, which had broken through a wall. In a few seconds, they heard Patrick's terrible voice. It's one of my tentacles, hasn't I, Sandy? And she was precisely his next prey. Do you want to know how the rest of this story plays out, TikTokers? This is just the beginning of a horror comic titled The Bikini Bottom Horror. As you've seen, the protagonist of this comic is an evil Patrick Star, who, after discovering his dark side, can't help but kill everyone inside and spread panic. This clashes head-on with the idea of the SpongeBob world we all have in our heads. Especially because in the show, Bob and Patrick are best friends. We are used to just seeing them getting into trouble or having a good time in Bikini Bottom. In these illustrations, we can find Sandy, Squidward, Mr. Krabs, Plankton, Larry, and even Bubble Bass. And although it has a lot of references to the original show, everything in the comic is very dark and terrifying. Like in many other instances, this is a creation of a fan of the show. It was published on the website, still in the simulation, and from then on, we've been checking more episodes. You can really tell how the comic has evolved, as the drawings have been improving over time and the story keeps going. Many people on the internet have enjoyed this horror comic very much, and it has many fans following it very closely. SpongeBob was created by Stephen Hillenburg and premiered on Nickelodeon in 1999. From then on, but especially from the year 2000, millions of children and adults keep watching SpongeBob's adventures in Bikini Bottom either on TV or online. Do you watch the show, TikTokers? Do you prefer the nice original version or the death and destruction of the Bikini Bottom horror? Who knows? Maybe both worlds could collide one day in the future. (coughs) 
If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like it. And if you want to see more Draw My Life videos, subscribe to our channel. See you in the next episode!